So hi guys, it's Albert Jenki. I have a B core. I went ahead and landed some um, connectors for the uh, battery. So this is what we're gonna do. We're gonna go ahead and make this light as possible. This is an EO10 Isheen frame. I'm not gonna use the uh, inductrix because it's a little bit too fragile for my taste. So let's start out by just cutting pretty much everything on it. Boom, start cutting that. Boom. Look at that guys, let's go ahead and weigh this. Five grams. And I'm not even done shaving it. Let's grab a Dremel and grind those little pieces away. Okay, there it is. So this will be going on top of this, just like that. So let's go ahead and mount those on. And that fits perfect at the bottom for the B core. See that? Okay guys, so that's pretty much level there. For my battery bracket, I'm gonna use these rubber bands. I'm just gonna put a few across and that's gonna be able to hold everything, as you can see. But first I'm gonna put the motors in. Clockwise will be going in the front or back here. So let's go in the front. Now let's get the black and white color and that will be counter clockwise. And always guys, try to grab it from the bottom of this. Don't grab the frame when you're putting your motors in. That could be detrimental to your frame. Okay, so now we're gonna go ahead and do motor number one. Last but not least, red and blue motor. That will be my third motor. Now I'm gonna go ahead and plug them in. Okay, so let's go ahead and plug it into the computer. I don't want to arm mine like that, so I'm gonna go here, set up uh, a life, so you can see. Okay, PIDs. That looks pretty good. Receiver, make sure it's on. All right, that's kind of weak. Okay, that's gotta be adjusted, so you guys can see it's backwards. My roll, as you can see right here, right is left and left is right. Now, one thing here, you notice, my endpoints are too high, so when I'm going to the left, they're at 1146, my tiny whip will not activate. I will not be able to arm it because that's way too high. So what do I do? So instead of what I'm doing, instead of adjusting each individual one at a time, then I'm just doing them all in one shot. Okay, motor number one. You gotta make sure it's going to be spinning in the right direction. Everything's in position. So now, what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna, instead of unplugging them, I'm gonna leave the motors in there and spin it. Now, let's organize this back here. There we go, go clockwise on this way. Red, clockwise. Okay, let's turn this thing on. Battery on. Make sure we're good. Okay, so let's put it in position now. All right guys, final product here, 21 grams. As a matter of fact, let's really, really put it to the test. Let me show you how it flies, guys, so you guys are gonna trip. Assembled today. B core with spectrum. <laughs> All right, guys. Hover junkie out. Thanks for watching.